Welcome to Tridentlogy. The channel that's all about fascinating facts and discoveries. In this episode, we'll discuss an interesting topic. Important questions to ask your partner before marriage. Are you ready to embark on a journey towards a fulfilling marriage? Discover the key to a successful union with our insightful discussions on the most important questions to ask your partner before saying, I do. Let love lead the way as we explore the path to lasting happiness together. Like, subscribe, and let's build a strong foundation for a lifetime of love. 1. Is there anything specific you'd like me to change? This appears to be a straightforward question, however it is not in this circumstance. You must realize that no matter how much your partner loves you, there must be something they want you to alter. It's perfectly normal, but it becomes abnormal when your spouse keeps it to themselves. When your partner has such an idea and does not tell you about it, it is critical to ask them, what change do you look for in me? It doesn't stop there. If you want to make any changes, make them before getting married. Two, what should I do if you are stressed or agitated? This is very crucial. It is critical to learn what to do when your partner is depressed or enraged. When people are furious, they virtually all react differently. It is psychologically, physiologically, intellectually, and otherwise in man's nature. It's generally tolerable if you're in a relationship, but if you're thinking about getting married, understanding this will spare you a lot of heartbreak in the future. 3. How many children do you wish to have from us? It is critical that you ask your partners how many children they would like from you. This is quite helpful in determining how they will feel if you are unable to make them as they desire. Yes, no one knows what will happen tomorrow, but a clear understanding of their viewpoint and what they desire would go a long way. Again, make sure you understand their reaction if you fail to meet their expectations. If it's a serious one, you might want to reconsider. Most people thinking about marriage have discussed having children, how many they want, and even what school they would send them to. People rarely discuss the potential of having difficulty conceiving. Every day, people battle with infertility, and if you or your spouse do, it will be an extra advantage that you have discussed it in advance and know exactly what steps to follow. Instead of squabbling over options, you will face tough circumstances as a team. Four. What are the things that you can't change no matter what? Everyone has one or more attitudes that are difficult to change regardless of the situation. Even though women have their own unfavorable attitudes and habits, men exhibit the majority of them. They could include smoking, womanizing, unfaithfulness, laziness, and a variety of other behaviors. Most of the time, these are negative attitudes that were acquired as a habit at a young age and would be difficult to break. This inquiry is critical for identifying the unfavorable attitudes that people are unable to modify. When you find these views, you must reconsider whether they are compatible with you. It is also vital to share your own bad attitudes with them, and if they are comfortable with that, it is time to proceed. 5. What does marriage mean to you? This is a really deep question, and it is not intended for children or anyone with a small brain. This is the time to learn about your partner's intelligence quotient. Everyone responds differently to this question. However, your partner's reactions will tell you a lot about if they desire the same thing you want. Practically, the core of marriage should be obvious many years later. The early years may be obscured by pleasure and passion. However, if their responses are relevant to and consistent with your own conception of marriage, it's a green light. Remember that this activity will ensure or reassure you of what you desire to enter into. Again, if you have the same marriage ambitions and goals, you will have a successful marriage. 6. What are your career goals? Before marrying your partner, it is highly recommended that you inquire about their job goals. This is a strategy to ensure that the person you are about to marry has realistic job goals that will ensure a good marriage. Consider your and your partner's job goals and viability to get a sense of the marriage's possible status. You may decide to marry because you believe your partner is striving to be more than he or she is currently. 
Or you could enter a marriage believing they have no plans to advance, only to realize otherwise after the marriage and feel awful about it. Inquire about their aims and goals. Determine whether or not you can fit into their future career objectives. 7. What do you think about house chores? Housework is always a concern if not properly handled. This may appear absurd, but domestic housework has caused a large number of divorces all over the world, particularly among Westerners. It is critical to ask and comprehend your partner's perspective on domestic housework and compare it to your own. Marriage is a significant milestone in a relationship, and open and honest communication is vital for a strong foundation. By asking important questions before tying the knot, you can gain a deeper understanding of each other's values, expectations, and goals. Remember, taking the time to have these conversations can help you build a strong and fulfilling marriage based on trust, mutual understanding, and shared goals. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more content on personal development and self-improvement. See you in next video.